We have good news to bring you for Virgin Islanders as well as visitors. It is now easier to get from St. Thomas to St. Croix as a new airline is now offering several flights a day. Flight away. Welcome to the Virgin Islands. A ribbon cutting ceremony on Monday welcomed Fly the Whale to the territory. It'll be based out of St. Croix and it'll offer eight to nine flights a day to and from the Henry Roslin and Sarah Lee King airports. The new option for inner island travel will offer competition and more affordable fares. Governor Albert Bryan Jr. says this new airline answers the long awaited cries of Virgin Islanders for more flight options between the islands. Now all who are crying Make sure you start buying them ticket to fly into Ireland. Because a lot of people making a lot of noise. I want to make sure that the whale is full every day, Cape Air full every day, and silver full every day. Not just the whale. So in order to inspire you once again, here goes the spend. I thought about it, and we're going to start to inspire people to fly to the other island. So I like golf. So if you're flying, if you're a St. Thomas, flying to, to play golf, we're going to figure out a way to give you a nice little credit on your golf game, right? So you don't have to pay as much. We're going to try to expand it to all the things that we're doing because it's summer now, right? So if you want to go sun sailing in St. Thomas or you want to come to St. Croix to visit the fort or to take a tour, we're going to be able to give you a credit for that. Joe, take care of that. <laughs> so now we're doing two things, right? We're not only, we're not only connecting the islands, but we're bridging the economic divide between St. Thomas and St. Croix because the more people travel back and forth, especially the tourists, the bigger the spend because all we're trying to do every day is increase the spend, increase the stay, and increase the, uh, the, uh, the, increase the stay, the spend, and the hours that the tourists stay in the Virgin Islands. So every single day, we want to make sure that when tourists come on a cruise ship, they come back for a seven-day stay. If they come out in the, the, the day, we want to make sure the activities that go on to the night. They see one island, we want, to, want them to see the other two. We want to make sure we get out as much money as possible out of them before they leave here, leave this Virgin Islands. And while we're doing that, make sure that they have a good experience. Plans for Fly the Whale to bring these inner island flights to the VI were in the works before the pandemic hit, which obviously put a halt on those plans. So leaders say they are excited for this to finally have come to fruition this week.